Hey guys, this is Matt with bleepinjeep.com. Today I'm going to show you a tip on how to redeck your trailer. Uh, this tip will save you a little bit of time. So, uh, when I first decided I was going to do this, uh, I was pondering how to get all these bolt heads out. And uh, they're all rusted, and it's going to take me a lot of time because there's a million bolts in this thing. And basically, uh, we're not going to take them out, we're just going to break them off. And to do that, uh, all you need is a uh, a handsaw or a skill saw. So check this out. Look underneath, make sure that you're not cutting into the metal brackets. Here's the metal brackets you can see here. Uh, there's two axles here and there's a metal bracket here. And the bolts run right through here. And so all you're going to do is make two cuts, one on this side and one on this side. And then you can break those bolts loose and get all your wood off pretty quick. like that. There's that board. It really helps if you do every other board just like this. You can start on one end or the other just do every other board across. And then once you get that done you start with the middle board and work your way out. Otherwise what ends up happening is you get some boards in the middle that just bend the crap out of these uh, bars on the, in the middle here. They're not real strong, but uh, that seems to work. This was my first attempt right here, and as you can see, I cut them all at once. But what happens now is the entire thing moves, and if I pry too hard on that, it's just going to break the metal. And after I get all the uh, boards off and uh, clean up this little heads, here's the, here's what the old screws look like by the way. These are just self-tapping screws so I'll buy some more of these self-tapping screws, lay the boards on here and uh, just drill them right through make sure that they're in the metal and we'll be good to go. We've got all the wood off. I'd say it took me about an hour, an hour and a half by myself and as I mentioned before about half of these uh, little bolts broke off when I pulled the wood off and about half of them are still there. That's gonna be dependent on uh, how rotted your wood is. Mine was pretty rotted so it just pulled the bolts out. And now you're just gonna use whatever tool you have to uh, get those off. You can use a angle grinder with a cutoff wheel on it or you can just use a hammer. Alright, well that was just a quick tip. I hope you enjoyed it. Again, I'm Matt from Bleep and Jeep. If you have any questions, just uh, email me or put a post in the comments and I appreciate it. Subscribe right there if you like my videos. Thanks much.